Hello there. I'm here again, talking to myself. <laughs> Actually, no, I'm talking to you guys, whoever is in my audience. Anyway, I should be taking a nap. It's four o'clock in the afternoon, but boredom hits, and what? And when I feel that, I feel like doing something else. Forget about taking a nap. I'll just sleep tonight earlier. Today, I feel like eating palitao. Palitao is a Filipino dessert or it's a snack, right? Why am I doing all these Filipino desserts? Well, I miss it, you know. My Lola used to make a lot of those during the weekends, but I was never interested in the kitchen at the time. So I said, I'm thinking about it actually in Ilocano. They call it Dila Dila. Dila Dila means tongue because it's shaped like a tongue. Actually, it's rounded or oval shaped. Um, but they call it in Lucano Dila Dila. But in Tagalog, they call it Palitao. So Palitao means rise up okay? or flow. So my friend Belle told me when I mentioned it to her, she said, Oh, that's so easy. Just get some mochiko, put some water, mold it, flatten it, put water into a boil, trap those uh, molded uh, uh, rice cake or whatever you call it, and when it rises up, it's cooked, and then just roll it over, uh, I mean on coconut flakes or shredded coconut with sugar, mix with sugar, and then sprinkle some toasted sesame seeds and that's it and I said oh my god that's so easy I think I can do that anyhow since I don't have Mochiko and my favorite chef Banjo Merano mentioned about glutinous rice glutinous rice to use I don't have that either but I have this, it says rice flour. Same thing probably, it doesn't just say glutinous, but it's rice, rice flour, right? And I have this that I don't understand whatever is written, but I see puto, different colors of puto here. And I'm thinking they use glutinous rice for that, or maybe rice flour or whatever. So maybe I can use this. Well, I'm tweaking the recipe already. So why not? I'm going to use this. It says steam rice cake. Maybe it's a flour. It looks like a flour. I'm going to sift it. So it's going to be more fun. And then instead of using water, I'm going to use coconut milk. Well, same old stuff, right? You know, I'm gonna use uh, coconut uh, flakes anyhow, so why not? Coconut and coconut, right? They all mix together. Anyway, so that's about it. That's innovative cooking. I'm not going to follow the recipe, but I'll see if it works. Right? See you in a bit. Oops, two cups. Mm. I said one cup, so it's so easy to uh, to memorize. One cup of uh, water, but I'm gonna use one cup of coconut milk instead. an experiment so why not and then mix them together here it is oh, I don't think the coconut milk works it doesn't mold 
Look at this. There's so much particles. It doesn't blend. Maybe I should put uh, water. I'll use my new saucepan. I got this yesterday. The water is up to here. So I have enough uh, uh, place for the uh, rice cake to rise up. I'll wait for the water to boil. I'll use this uh, ice cream scooper so I have the same size. Oh, I think it's big. Oh, it's huge. This is huge. Oops. It's supposed to be a little bit. Maybe I cut it in half. Not perfect, but maybe I'll just do this. Flatten it like this. Oops. Ah, whatever. It's my first time, so it's okay. I'm not done yet. And the shapes are not perfect. And it's okay, it's my first time. Water is boiling. Let's drop the small ones. Oh, one floated up already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Floaters galore. Well, well, I have different shapes of <laughs> of paditao or dila dila, whatever you call it. I'm gonna mix the uh, the one that you have to roll on those uh, palitaos. So this is uh, one cup of shredded coconut. This one, half a cup of uh, toasted sesame seeds, and half a cup of sugar. To your taste. This is good enough for me. There you go. There you go. It doesn't look like my Lola's. Uh, Palitao, but I'll see how it tastes. Okay, taste test. A small one. Mm. 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 My Lola's was uh, a little bit softer, if I can remember. But this one is good too. Bon appetit!